everyone and welcome to 27. So it would appear that I'm finally experiencing the joys of Lotus ownership um, for the first time. So I've been telling one and all and everybody how incredibly reliable and fantastic and how much better the Esprit has been than I was expecting. And I really shouldn't have done that because last weekend I was in Oxford working on the Porsche and I was driving back and the car sort of started randomly cutting out as if uh, it was running out of petrol. Eventually it conked out altogether on the side of the M40. So cut a long story short, I had it towed to a service station nearby where someone else was going to pick it up and take it to Gerald at GST uh, to have him see what was going on. And it started right up. But I didn't want to risk it because I had a free tow over to take it to a garage. So I got them to take it over there anyway. <clears throat> Gerald had a look at it. Again, it started up in their workshop, then it just cut out. Um, so he had a look uh, and he ended, ended up changing the pickup and the amplifier power lead, cleaning up all the connections, did a really thorough job, left the car running, took it out for half an hour, left it running in the workshop for half an hour, everything fine. I then went over all the way to um, Newmarket, which is quite far from me, I'm the other side of London, and drove it all the way back here, two and a half hours, no problem whatsoever. Then yesterday, uh, had someone come over to have a look at it. We went, took it out, and it did about 50 meters, and then started cutting out, and then cut out all over again. I had a look where all the wiring goes into the box there with uh, the coil, um, the amplifier power module, um, unplugged, uh, redid, recrimped, redid all the wiring there, checked out the wiring going to that, to the amplifier module, to the coil, everything else. And then the car started. I took it for a drive, half an hour, no problem, went perfectly. This morning the guy came back to see it, it started up, ran for about three minutes, then stopped. You know, I've been trying to get it started and touch one of the connections to see which, which, where it is that it's actually, you know, it, it's intermittent, but it doesn't seem to respond to anything particular, any connection being touched or anything. So anyway, I'm stumped. <laughs> So, um, I don't know. I am really stumped at what it could be, uh, but there you go. We'll find out what it is eventually, I don't know. I think next step maybe is to try and change the coil, see if that sorts it out. Um, but we'll see, I'm in touch with Gerald anyway, and uh, we'll see how it goes. But um, keep tuned, um, loving the Esprit. <laughs> 